Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Um, I'm saying that because I've not posted any video in this new year so you guys have not seen me in this new year so that's why I'm telling you guys happy new years how are you guys doing in 2021 I hope you guys are great I hope your family uh, members are doing okay now so today I'm gonna be doing another one for you guys it's not necessarily gonna be a makeup tutorial <sighs> I'm not doing a makeup tutorial guys I'm basically just gonna be doing my makeup with Juvia products okay I know you guys know Juvia Juvia is one of the biggest black owned you know makeup brands out there and i love juvia okay this is not a sponsored post this is not a sorry this is not a sponsored video they did not pay me okay i'm just out here supporting a black owned business oh god all right so um the only thing that is not going to be juvia is my primer and my you know of course the pencil i'm going to be using for my eyebrow and my brushes all right so i'm going to be using different juvia eyeshadow palette um if you go if you scroll down to my previous videos you would see um when i reviewed each and every one of them um i've been using this now for at least almost the whole year almost a whole year and i decided to get them in this pack because i was like i'm not gonna get one if you go on the site trust me you would want to get just one but something will just pinch you and just tell you guy you gotta get more and that's that's what happened that's why i have it looks like a freaking textbook but i'm gonna be using this right here i'm not gonna be using all of them but i'm just gonna be picking just a few colors from you know each of them um, i have the juvia foundation um this is lagos 240 my shade lagos 240 five i don't know if you guys can see that that's the contour um this is the concealer in 13 Got this the highlight stick because it's like a, it comes out like a lipstick maybe that's what it's actually called i don't really know what's actually called but yeah that's what i call it the highlight stick um i have this in uh panama my shade setting powder juvia setting powder gobi which is g-o-b-i that's a setting powder mm -hmm. highlighter in Cleo. So so these are these are come on if you're a makeup girl, these are basically the only things that you need to perfect that look and give you that outstanding finish. You know what I'm saying? So those are the things I'm gonna be using. I'm gonna be chit chatting a little bit with you guys. I mean it's been a while, right? I just don't want to I don't want you guys to be skipping the video. So I want you guys to be engaging with me or I'm gonna be engaging with you guys. Just talking about like different stuff while I do my makeup, you know, so it's to be fun, right? let's get it all right i'm gonna start with my 2k gold primer i'm just gonna be putting just a little bit at the tip of my finger just like so oh it's a little bit it's gooey just tap it and so um do you guys um know about clubhouse because I mean, I feel like Clubhouse is everywhere now. You know, I wanted to talk to you guys about Clubhouse. I mean, I don't want to talk to you guys about Clubhouse. Like, it's my app. But I just wanted us to just, like, you know, communicate about Clubhouse. And I want, I want to hear you guys' opinions and thoughts about, like, what you think about the app. People who don't know what Clubhouse is. Clubhouse is, you know, like, Clubhouse is just like Twitter. You know how you go on Twitter and you type in how you feel and then other people retweet and tweet and all that clubhouse is uh, like us is a social app that you can meet people from different parts of the world they go in there um they talk instead of posting pictures and tweets they actually talk and you guys like talk you have people from different parts of the world different time zones um you know talk about different things you know you have people i mean you can you can decide the room that you want to um, be a part of. You know what I'm saying? You can you can join any room at all. Um, there's a lot of uh, people doing different things there. Um, it's very informative as, as well. You know, you can learn a lot of stuff depending on your interests and what you like. Um, if you're the kind of person that likes investing, Bitcoin, cryptocurrency, stock markets, and all that good stuff there, you know, talks about it for beginners. And I mean, if you're the relationship type, you just broke up with your man or you just broke up with your girl and um, you, you know, you need advice or something, you know, they, they are like people there to advise you as well. 
um just like different stuff and i'm not gonna lie the first time i joined clubhouse i was like i'm not going nowhere anymore you know how you're in, like you just like staying on your own and then something like this that is making you just remain in your house comes out that's how it was for me because i mean i was like i enjoy i enjoy just sitting in my house and just looking at myself like this and then clubhouse came i was like let's get it join clubhouse i was it was very interesting i'm not gonna lie it was different you know usually when when you see something that is brand new something that you don't really know you're like you want to jump on it and it's so much fun because it's the first time you're trying it right that was how it kind of was for me i was like i was like yay clubhouse this is this is my this is my shiza you know this is my thing this is where i'm just where i'm gonna be at when i'm not working or when i'm not busy it's where i'm gonna be at and i mean the first week like i said was really nice it is what you make of it like there are rooms that you enter they're just talking about things that don't make no sense you know what i'm saying is your job to exit the room is is your job to look for rooms that would um positively impact you or something you know you know go go into a room that would actually make you learn something basically so you know, it is what you make of it so I mean like i said it's an app for only iphone users right now i don't know why it's just for iphone users but yeah it's an app right now for iphone users i'm not gonna lie clubhouse is wild i mean it is wild there are days that you go in there they're talking about the, the unspeakable okay the absolute unspeakable you have to be prepared you have to be seriously prepared to go in there and like <laughs> you need to know what you're actually getting into before you get into whatever the heck you want to get into to be honest with you i'm not even gonna lie because there are there are rooms that you get into and they'll put you on the spot they'll put you on the spot and me personally i just got tired of it i just got tired of you know being in being in rooms that are, that just just talk about like stupid stuff i mean i feel like there should be a time for everything and you know if come on you're not going to be talking about the same thing the same thing every single time you're not going to be talking about the same thing every single time and that's the, that's the thing that kills me if i go in one particular room are you guys talking about the same thing today tomorrow next tomorrow when i mean the same thing i'm not, I'm not talking about something meaningful i'm talking about something stupid smash or pass kill marry the you know it gets old it gets really really old it's like so you guys are seriously not going to talk about anything else all right so that's what i was saying you have to pick the rooms that you want to go to okay and that's what i had to learn how to do because when i first joined clubhouse there was this particular room that i loved to enter every single day you know when you're a newbie now you want to try everything and see you know go to the place that you are going really kind of gonna like relates to you know so that was where you know i was at every time and i just realized that the room as i kind of got older in the whole clubhouse game i just realized that the room was not it was not contributing anything to my life i mean like i want to learn stuff i want to talk about stuff i don't want to talk i don't want to be talking about the same the same the same smash or pass or or who 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 would you take home like who would you do this to who would you, like it just gets old i'm sorry maybe i'm just too old maybe, maybe i'm just too old for it but like i said i don't mind you doing it sometimes but not every time like i feel like it's just too much I'm gonna go simple because i'm not like i said it's like a makeup tutorial it's nothing serious i just wanted to you know show you guys um the gvr products that i have so i'm gonna think i'm, I'm thinking of, i'm thinking of going with this color right here and i'm just gonna be doing the one color I mean, you guys can see how pigmented it is. Like, it's just in another world. Bro. Anywho, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, I've actually learned a lot of things. I've learned a lot of things, and and it's actually making me a lot more open-minded because you know I'm getting to you know hear other people's opinion and 
and I'm getting to understand um, the importance of um, the importance of there are two sides to every story or you have to look at situations from another angle or another perspective and I'm not gonna lie I used to battle with that thing before I used to be like brah Oh guy, if you're not seeing it my way, what are you talking about? Like, what you mean, you know? But, nah, Clubhouse actually helped me to have an open mind. Have an open mind and listen to other people's opinion. And look, you guys may or may not agree. It's fine. Like, if I don't see things from your point of view or if you don't see things from my point of view, it's okay. Like, it doesn't mean you're wrong. At the end of the day, some information like are subjective. You know what I'm saying? If if they're not factual, if they're not proven, it's subjective. So as far as it's subjective, nobody is right. Nobody is right. Nobody is wrong. So, well, that's kind of um, one of the things that Clubhouse made me realize and open my eyes to you know accepting people's opinion and and it can actually open your eyes to a lot of stuff too. I mean hear people's experiences and nine times out of ten you probably have the same experience with that person so is or you realize like wow so people actually went through this or wow people have this experience like you know it's to make you appreciate life or appreciate your situation or appreciate where you are in life um yeah so so yeah Clubhouse is it's crazy. It's a, it's, a, it's a crazy spot now. Like, it's a crazy spot, but you learn a lot. You learn a lot. Like I said, um, so I'm going to be using this right here. Like I said, um, it depends on the room that you choose to go to. Pick your, pick your room wisely. Um, pick your room wisely. It's just, you know, pff. open your eyes. So I'm gonna be using this right here. Yeah, so if you haven't joined Clubhouse yet, join no is fun, especially in this quarantine period where a lot of people are at home, nobody's going anywhere. It's a time for you to actually <laughs> digitally, virtually meet different people from different parts of the world. I mean, I mean, they have people from different works of the world on clubhouse so why not do it right and uh if you're currently on clubhouse let me know i want to because i love you see one thing about clubhouse now like i said one thing that clubhouse has taught me is hearing people's opinion and accepting it so if you're on clubhouse please let me know do you like it do you hate it what are your honest opinions about it? Let me know. Maybe we got maybe we are both thinking the same thing. Alright, some of my last one. So this one we'll be using. Oh, do you not want to join? Or I mean, do you want to join? Cause it's pretty exclusive now. You need an invite before you can come in. And even though you like sign up, God knows how long you have to wait before they like accept you in or something. So it's a whole thing. All right, so I'm using the Juvia Foundation in let me see, Lagos 240. Let me know. I want to know like what you guys think about it and if you guys are using it, what's up? What's up? Like, what do you think? I mean, I'm not gonna lie, I've seen some crazy things on Clubhouse, like, shoot. I'm saying these, they're gonna be Clubhouse weddings, Clubhouse hookups, Clubhouse pregnancies, Clubhouse engagements. Shoot, Clubhouse everything, okay? Like, this year is a year of Clubhouse, every single thing. So y'all be ready. Just know you heard it from me first. You heard it here first. Concealer in 13, number 13. That's so I was saying. I've seen some, I've seen some messed up things 
I mean, when I say messed up, I mean drama. People fighting, people cursing each other out. I'm like, bro, it's not even that deep. Sitting out someone you probably never, ever see in life. <laughs> You're cursing out someone you probably never, ever see in life. Or because of what? Yeah, so, I mean, you guys, if you guys don't know what I'm talking about, just tell your friends. I'm pretty sure one of them would know what Clubhouse is and they can invite you. They can invite you. Um, but yeah, you can't really get in without an invite. Um, if you don't get an invite, yeah, you'll be on that you'll be on that waiting train for a while. You'll be on that waiting train for a long time because um, you know, since it's a new app, you know, I'm thinking they are still trying to perfect it and that's why it's not on Android yet. It's just an iPhone thing. So I'm using my contour in Call of Color 5. This hair is killing me, guys. It's killing me. All right. So this is very thick. That's why I'm not putting a lot. Like, this thing right here, do not play. This is fuck. set it with the setting powder in Gobi G-O-B-I loose highlighter I'll be right back for the finished look okay Okay guys, so this is the final look. I'm not gonna be. <laughs> but this is the final look guys. Um, What do you guys think about it? Like, let me know in the comment section below what you think about this look. Do you like it? Do you not like it? Let me know what you guys think. Um, as I said earlier, um, I used all Juvia's Place Cosmetic. And um, this is it. This is not a makeup tutorial. This is just me just goofing around and basically talking about random stuff so um if you guys know about uh, clubhouse let me know in the comment section below let's talk about it let's let's converse about uh clubhouse and what you think let me know what you think about this look is it a look is it a ooh, or uh oh you know let me know in the comment section below what you guys think and um thank you guys so much if you're a new subscriber thank you for subscribing if you're not subscribed yet please 
before you click this video please subscribe or before you click another video please subscribe thank you and like if you haven't liked it yet just give me that give it that thumbs up and um comment let me know what you think about this video in the comment section below and down there i'm putting the information to all you know the products that i used in the description box below so if you want to go check the gvs place out you can as i said earlier again this is not a sponsored post they did not pay me for this this is not a sponsored video at all so i'm just doing this out of the goodness of my heart and supporting a black owned business so go check them out they have really nice good stuff so as you can see my look right here is all gvs place it's all gvs place so let your girl know what you think okay in the comment section below let me know let me know but anyways thank you guys so much for tuning into this youtube video i hope you guys have a blessed day and um i'm gonna be seeing you guys next video bye